Good evening. My life today for September 1st. The reading is entitled, Holy Sanctified, Body, Soul, and Spirit. The scripture reading is taken from 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 23. The very God of peace sanctify you wholly, and I pray God, your whole spirit and soul and body, be preserved blameless unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. The sanctification set forth in the sacred scriptures has to do with the entire being, spirit, soul, and body. Here is the true idea of entire consecration. Paul prays that the church at Thessalonica may enjoy this great blessing. The very God of peace sanctify you wholly, and I pray God your whole spirit and soul and body be preserved blameless unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. True sanctification is an entire conformity to the will of God. Rebellious thoughts and feelings are overcome, and the voice of Jesus awakens a new life which pervades the entire being. Those who are truly sanctified will not set up their own opinion as a standard of right and wrong. They are not bigoted or self-righteous. But they are jealous of self, ever fearing, lest a promise being left them, they should come short of complying with the conditions upon which the promises are based. Bible sanctification does not consist in strong emotion. Here is where many are led into error. They make feelings their criterion. When they feel elated or happy, they claim that they are sanctified. Happy feelings or the absence of joy is no evidence that a person is or is not sanctified. There is no such thing as instantaneous sanctification. True sanctification is a daily work, continuing as long as life shall last. Those who are battling with daily temptations overcoming their own sinful tendencies and seeking for holiness of heart and life make no boastful claims of holiness. They are hungering and thirsting for righteousness. Sin appears to them exceedingly sinful. Genuine sanctification is nothing less than a daily dying to self and daily conforming to the will of God. Thank you for listening.